Okay, so what I've done, uh, it's fabricated a, uh, a back plate and this insulation plates which will protect the um, samples where we clamp them down. And then we've got a blocker which straightens it. So we tap up uh, and we hold, once we put them all in, once we put them all in, we can knock them up, put, pop them all in, and then we can use our tapper to put them, push them all to the back plate. Once we push it to the back plate, we wind down our clamp, and we can wind it down quite tight because we've got the insulation on the black plate that we've fabricated for the machine. So it squishes them all down, but it's not going to harm your samples as well. Um, so once we close the lid, we can cut this nice and flat. Okay. So we've kind of, because these are all a bit uneven nowadays, as we've cut them a few times, but you can see the samples have kind of cut through there quite easily. But because we've done two sides, they are a bit mismatched and a bit uneven as we've put them in. Once they're all uh, the same size, um, it'll be nice to have them. When we get the proper samples, they'll be all the same lengths and not halves, um, so we can get kind of a, a better idea of them. Yep, because they're coming out. Cool. Brilliant.